So this is gesso. This is a substance, normally we'd put it over a hand stretched canvas to make it ready to paint on if we were to use oil paints. Uh, but it, gesso has a great texture to it and dries pretty much however you leave it. So what we're using it for here is to make a paintable surface on our mixed media project. So basically I'm just going to move the knife around and let it pull up in some areas and flatten out in others until I get the texture that I want. And this can take some time. You can use a palette knife, you can use a brush, depending on whatever texture you want. Once you're comfortable with how it looks, you just set it aside for the day and probably wait until tomorrow before you paint over it. All right, now I'm gonna show you how to add some actual texture using newspaper and Elmer's glue. So I'm gonna to need to paint the Elmer's glue on. So I'm gonna pour it first into this cup. It's a little bit, we don't actually need a lot for this. And then I'm gonna pour just a little bit of water. And mix it up until it gets into a pretty good paste. I'm going to take a strip of newspaper, I'm going to soak it in there until it's all nasty. All right, here for the messy part, you're going to take it out. Again, slanted surface, that's why everything's falling. And you have to wring out the newspaper part. Try to clean up your workspace as much as possible. And from here out, all you've got to do is place where you want your textured surface to be and how you want it textured. So I'm just going to start bunching this up, smoothing it out until you've got it the way you want it.